everybody. Um, hi everybody, my name is Pune. I am going to paint with you step by step and uh, we are gonna paint a beautiful um, blossom spring flowers uh, with a beautiful color, teal color and uh, so we need um, black, yellow, white, red, teal color and purple. So, but if you don't have teal color and purple, we can make it with um, different um, colors. So we need, if you don't have it, we need a little bit blue color too. So it's a ultramarine blue color. And I'm going to paint, so you can, um, I'll give you time to bring your um, painting uh, art supplies. You need canvas, brushes, paint, and um, so this is the canvas. You should bring it closer. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so. We are going to paint with this brush. Uh, I'm going to take a teal color and then from the top, going all the way down. I'm going to add a little bit white too because it's very dark. So it's going to be. This. this okay now so I'm going to add more white and going to the left and right okay, I'm going to the left and right if you have like some highlight here that's fine it's it's gonna be pretty color. So again, white. I add white. I fill all the white part with this color so out. So if you wanted to make this color, teal color, you can um, mix blue, a little bit green, and mix it together. Blue and green. And you can add white or make it lighter. I'm going to add a little bit blue. So, so, and blend it. Add more teal color and blend it. A little blue up here. And if you go 
been left and left several times. It's going to be blended. So I go one more time. One more layer. And just lay down your brush and very softly go to the left and the right. Like that left and the right. Okay. Okay, so now we are going to um take the small flat brush and this is a small flat brush and make brown color with uh, black uh, yellow and red mixed together it's gonna be brown so if you add more yellow it's gonna be light brown so black yellow and red and then i'm gonna take some extra paint from my brush and then i am going to start from here um So use your um, tip of your brush and then go and then just tip of your brush and very lightly and some branches If you push your brush, you have a big line like that. And if you wanted to have a very um, tiny line, small line, just hold your brush like that. And then very lightly use your tip and add some more um, branches like a V shape. Again, and then you can uh, put some curve make it more pretty and also if it's hard for you with this brush you can use the small um, brush like that and so Branches and so and then I'm going to add more from here. I change my brush to the the other one, so I have a like big line here, and keep on with just use the tip of your brush and have a very fine line.
So I am going to um, add more branches. Okay, now you can wash your brush and take a round brush um, like that and take uh, some um, some red and white color. And um, so just take white and red so you can see both color on my brush. And then very and use your tip of your brush for the tip of the each petal like that. I will show you like that. So each um Pedal, you can see both color. It's like that. Sorry, okay, now keep going and add more this color and shape. And then you can add some in between. The branches. Um, I think we need more um, light. Okay, that's better.
just keep going and add more flowers. So you can paint uh, this simple painting, anyone can paint this. And um, you don't need to have experience. Okay, now um, I'm going to work my brush and you can draw it with your paper towel. And then um, this time for this one, I like to add I like to use my purple and white and the same things. But you have, I have a red here too, but use this white and red to replace it. Even you can use a lot of um, And just doing the same thing. Take purple and white, and I didn't mix it, and just use the tip. And I put like one, two, three, four. One, two, three. Different. Shape some of them three, some of them four. Petals. And just keep adding more. Flowers. So you can see it's so simple and no need to have experience. Everyone can paint this beautiful painting and make you so relaxed and calm. And then you can create your masterpiece after less than one hour. It's gonna be so awesome. So you just keep adding more flowers. And you can see some of them has a texture because I put a lot of paint and then when it's dry so you cannot see the background because some of these, the background was wet. So maybe I'm going to add one more layer. The 
fifteen one. So you can add one branches here and then add more. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so now see it's almost done. I don't know how long it took, but if you want to make it better with some detail, so you can use the, uh, this brush and again take some um, black this time and add black color here. Just the line here. And then I'll do that here. And then you can blend the line like that. <laughs> so you can put half of your brush to the um, brown, half on black, and just drag it to the top. Here. I'm trying to put this dark line under each branches for the um, like more shadow and under. I think I need more, one more layer for this one because the back one was red. And then, so we need um, one more layer of red and white. So you can see both color on my brush.
Then you can add more um, here. Make it bigger. More pretty. Um, so one more layer. If you can wait and stay when you put the background color, you can stay like 15 minutes or 20 minutes and then it's going to be dry. Then you don't need to back and put one more layer because it's dry and it sit on your canvas. Okay. I like to add um, a little bit more um, green color for the leaves. I like to have the leaves too. So, um, um, okay. Um, so I, this is green color. And I am going to take the same brush, wash my brush, and load my brush with yellow and green. Yellow and green. And then put some, just one small When we put the three or four petals, so we just put one um, for the legs, like that. And then put some in between. If you want to have a dark, um, dark green, add a little bit blue and green mixed together. So some part like down here, a little bit more dark green. And then this side, again, Green and I mean, when I add some uh, green and yellow color leaves, um, it's more colorful. Uh, I like the colorful painting. If you see my website, paintingwineparties.com, at page shop my painting. So you can see all my painting, it's very colorful. I love color, so. Um. Let me bring this um, camera closer. So 
so uh, when you wanted to paint very fast and with, like for beginner and uh, this painting is good but if you wanted to add more detail it's gonna be better later um, but this is just for the beginner people they never paint before so it's gonna be so easy for them to paint something like that and but for the detail i have some painting um take like two months or three months with a lot of detail and layer Okay, so this is like more And then I'm going to wash my brush a little bit um, purple and white. I put here. Yeah. It has some red too. It's okay. There's a lot of paint. Because some of them it's need more one layer. So these are I like to add more um, red and white here too. And some leaves. Okay, this is the um, simple painting for people for people who are beginner. Um, so probably one. So when you are done, then you can. Write your name with the round brush here, sign your name. My name is Pune, P-O-U-N-E-H, done. So you can have your painting like that. Thank you for watching. I hope enjoy and um, okay. We paint this painting in thirty six minutes. That's awesome. <laughs> so you can paint a painting in like a little bit more than half an hour. A beautiful painting and create your masterpiece. Thank you and have a great day. Bye.